Hi, I'm Jeff Apshear. I'm the director of the Kalamazoo Book Arts Center. The Kalamazoo Book Arts Center is a nonprofit organization that was founded 16 years ago by a group of artists and writers who had a vision to create a studio where we could do traditional book arts, uh, letterpress printing, paper making, uh, book binding, and other kinds of print, print making, and also have programs like exhibitions and visiting artists, poetry readings, and do uh, educational programs for people of all ages. We have uh, been working here in the Book Art Center for over a decade when we first moved into this new space to expand it. So now we have a, a, one of the largest uh, facilities in the Midwest where we can do all the things that we do. The programs that we run, we also have an internship program uh, where we have uh, students from the university and young adults in the community who come and work with us and help us in the projects that we do. Uh, for over 10 years now, we've been doing a program called Poets in Print, where we do posters that are printed of poets' uh, work with uh, images by visual artists in limited edition prints. And we now have over 150 editions of Poets in Print broadside posters. In the last five years, we've also begun making handmade books uh, that include the work of poets and artists in limited editions, often on handmade paper and all printed and bound by hand. So uh, in addition to the educational programs that we have, we do production um, and we do uh, outreach into the community. And we host uh, artists and other creative people in our studio. This is our letterpress studio. Um, and in this studio, we do all the typesetting and printing of the text that goes into the books that we create. So around me here are uh, over 20 cabinets of type uh, that is either wood or metal type. Um, we have examples of wood type here that's locked up in this chase. And this type will go into presses like these. Uh, these are Vanderbilt presses that are used to create, um, uh, to, to print type. So the type would go on the, uh, the surface here and then the rollers would be inked and the paper would be loaded and the carriage would move across and print the letters on the page. Uh, when we're doing books, uh, we print one page at a time. Okay, this is uh, our paper making studio. It's the Paul Robert paper making studio. Paul Robert was a university professor and authority on paper making going all the way back to the 1960s, who built a lot of the equipment that we have in our studio. And then uh, eventually that was donated by his family to the Book Art Center. So here we have the ability to make paper of all kinds and different sizes. We use different kinds of fibers to, um, to create sheets of paper. This vat um, here has some purple fiber in it. It's cotton fiber. And if I were going to make a piece of paper, I would use a mold like this one and a decal that goes on top of it that, that you could then scoop into the uh, vat and take out some of the paper to create a sheet, which would then be pressed on one of these belts here. And then when the felts are stacked one on top of the other, we put them into this press, which is a hydraulic press that puts 2,000 pounds of pressure on the, on the fiber to smash it into a sheet of paper. Then when it comes out of here, it's formed into a sheet of paper and we transfer it into the press that's over here. It is a drier press where it stays overnight to dry the paper out Flat. This is the um, Calvin's Book Art Center's retail store. Uh, we're open during our regular hours all week, um, Monday through Friday, 10 to 5. And in here, we sell all the different things that we make here at the Book Art Center. So, for example, we have a rack here of different cards that we've made. These are cards that are both letterpress printed or linoleum cut images. We also have um, handmade books that we sell. These are blank journals, different kinds and styles uh, that you can purchase in our store. We also sell uh, posters, um, posters that either we either create here or also other artists who create posters and sell them 
through our store. In addition, over here we have a wide selection of decorative papers. Some of these papers are stuff that uh, we purchase other places and sell through our store, but also a lot of these are papers that we create here at the Book Art Center for sale. And then finally, in this section of the store, we have merchandise that we've created here, that uh, the books and the broadside posters that we make. So these are examples of some of the Poets in Print broadsides that were created for the poetry readings that we have here in our studio.